So the best warrior competition, um, the history of it, we've done it for about six years now in the state. Prior to this year, we've always held uh, paper boards uh, throughout the units, and, and what that entails was the battalion sergeant majors from each unit would uh, pick the soldiers that they they selected from each battalion, and then at the state level, uh, a group of sergeant majors would get together and we'd run our own paper board, and we'd select the best NCO and soldier out of that, and then those soldiers would compete at the regional competition. So this year we got 11 soldiers that are competing um, from across all the different units throughout the state in the best warrior competition. For, for the best of the best, um, we're, we're going to be conducting an APFT, a weapons qual. Um, we, we got a, a written writing assignment that each one of the soldiers are going to be doing in COs. Then we have a tactical combat casualty care. Um, we have weapons qual. Um, we've got a uh, round robin of weapons. Uh, the Mark 19, the 50 cal, the 240, and the 249 that the soldiers are going to be training on and, and testing on. And then we have an oral board where all the soldiers and NCOs will sit in front of the sergeant majors and we'll ask them questions. And then from that, we'll pick the, the top that the scored the best out of each of them. Definitely the rock march, I would think. I've never been good at rock marches since basic, but it doesn't seem like it'll be too bad if it's only six miles. The weapons qualifications, I've always liked shooting weapons and all that. Um, they came here today at 1500 and they're going to be going until about noon on Sunday non-stop. Um, most of the nights that we're, we're going to be running night land navigation, one night that's going to be running until about 2400. So each tonight and tomorrow night they're going to be working until about 2400 and getting up at 05 to, to start the competition. I think it's going to be a good event for our soldiers and again it's about not only the soldiers uh, going to the region, and I would like to see Wyoming win the competition, but really it's giving them an experience and getting some training for them.